Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to Oakwood Zoo, official Oakwood Zoo, I might add, which I'll talk about in a second. So, today we are continuing enclosures for the Oceana Pack animals. We Last week, just over actually a week ago, we built for the flying foxes. Um, we built a small little aviary for them, um, and that was really appreciated from you guys. Um, I was surprised uh, how many people saw that and how many like, comments. I love reading your guys' comments. So, and with that, I have a very exciting news. Um, I have bought a PC. So, uh, in the past, or before today, actually, before this episode, I use Mac with my GeForce now. Um, so, I can't use billboards, I can't use mods, um, and it, it, I can't use Oakwood Zoo because Oakwood Zoo keeps crashing, and anytime we get, like, re like start to get a bit big in zoo size, then the game crashes and it will never let me back in. So, with me getting a PC, and I did put this on a community post, um, uh, a couple days ago. With a PC, I can do all those things. I can use mods, I can use... Um, not that I'm going to, I've, I've been thinking about it. I'm still gonna deciphering if I want to or not. Um, uh, I can use mods, I can use uh, custom billboards, which you'll see me use um, later in this video. And we can open Oakwood Zoo again, and we can make it bigger than I originally had. So you'll notice that when we, in the cinematic shots, or even building this um, part of it, you'll see the rest of the zoo from earlier episodes. So it's finally in. So which means that I will be taking everything we have built from the past like four months up until like the Gibbon enclosure, which is the last thing we built in the actual zoo. Um, everything we've built up until then, I have made into blueprints, and I have to put in back into the zoo. So right now, the zoo looks kind of incomplete in the um, in the cinematic shots, but we have like ten new enclosures to add to it. So we de it definitely is going to come together. It just takes time to. Um, I'm going to need some time to put the blueprints back. But in the meantime, we will continue, like I said, building for the Oceana animals, starting off with the little blue penguins today. So this is something, uh, another reason why it took me so long to upload an another video. One was the PC and getting it set up and stuff and um, figuring things out. And the other thing was um, uh, uh, building this. Now this is one of my favorite builds. I know it might not be the most detailed, but it, it from a cinematic shot of it, or a cinematic point of view, it, I really like it. It looks beautiful. I love the glass windows and stuff in the um, entry. I think I did cut the um, the starting recording of me actually building the out outside exterior, which I am sorry about. I think I probably um, forgot to build that um, while recording. My bad. Everything else is good, though. Everything else, you'll see me build the inside of it, build all the planters and stuff. You'll see me use the Oceana Pack um, foliage a lot, because that is probably one of the most unique, one of the most, like, um, useful Turn, um, sets of foliage we've had. That and the Tropical Pack, um, those two packs this year have been really top-notch for foliage, and even the Arid Pack had give us that, um, a couple new bushes and stuff that I use really often. So, yeah, foliage this year has been top-notch. Anyway, so the future plans. So, uh, we are going to be back in Oakwood Zoo now. So, uh, my plan is to, we have the little blue penguins. This is only part one, actually. We're building the building partly the indoor display of the penguins and then in about a week or so we will build the outdoor display for the penguins now in between that gap we will also build for the quokkas which will be on that side area of the building of the penguin building um we are actually almost done the oceana section of um oakwood zoo uh, i did some touch-ups and stuff to uh the other enclosures and stuff um, and I still plan to do a couple more touch-ups I have to do. I mainly updated the sign for Australia or Oceania. I changed the name to Oceania because now we have Oceania and Australia. It just made sense if it was more just Oceania. Um, but yeah, so we are going to build for the Quokkas probably Monday or Tuesday. That will not have a uh, voiceover, so it'll be like a really quick mini episode because it's a very small enclosure. Um, then past that, uh, and next week, near the end of the week, we will probably build the outdoor enclosure for the penguins. And then the week after that, uh, in the beginning, I'm trying to do two videos a week. One in the earlier part of the week, either like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. And then one in the later part of the week. Alright, future me here. Uh, just want to jump in here and pause for a second because I know that with me talking about the schedule in these next couple minutes, I know it got screwed up because this uh, video was supposed to be out on Friday but it got pushed to Monday, um, which is kind of sad. Um, 
I, I really tried to get it out on Friday. I know it's been like a large gap. It's been like at least 10 days since our last one, the Flying Fox Aviary, which I am sorry about. Um, I'm really hoping to get caught up. I just want to say this probably what I'm going to have to talk about still won't change. Uh, I know this video is going up on Monday. I'm going to try the next episode to get done on Wednesday or Thursday. And then I'm going to hopefully get the in the outdoor area of the penguins done on Saturday, but I might not be able to. I'm going to try and get that done either Saturday or Sunday, like the video uploaded on Saturday or Sunday. I really don't know, though, if I can get that done. I know the quokka habitat will be done, so either way, we will have two videos this week. Um, one is this one, and one is the quokkas, which will definitely get done by the end of the week. Uh, sorry for the delay, guys. Um, back to present me. So, next week, penguins and quokkas, week after that, the Tasmanian Devils, and we will be having a tour video of everything we have from Oakwood Zoo. So that is what to come in two weeks, um, because the last tour video we did was like in April, and we have built for so many things since then. I just need to put all those blueprints into the zoo, and then we will have a lot more of a completed zoo. Um, and I have everything ready to plan out and stuff. I've updated my list. I've added a few more things. Um, so I am now okay if we go a bit over um, my deadline, which I wanted to finish the suit by the end of 2023. I will maybe extend it about a month or two past that because there's now a couple more because we're a bit more flexible. I can add a few more creatures um, around the perimeter and stuff and enlarge it. And then also we're probably we're definitely getting a winter pack for uh, Planet Zoo, so we'll also have probably eight new animals. I'm assuming it's going to be a scene, an animal pack, so eight new animals. We'll probably have to fit those in somewhere, um, especially if it's the pack that I really want. Um, but you can check out my um, Fall and Winter DLC speculation video for that if you're interested. There you go. Top right, left, uh, left? No, right. Top right corner, <laughs> I heard. Um, if you want to go check that out, or after you're done this video, you can check that out. Anyway, so uh, I think that's all I have to say. I didn't really talk about the build that much, but I do really love this build. Um, I, I don't know what it is. I never talk about my builds when I'm actually doing the voiceovers. It's just, I don't know, it's just not interesting for me. I like showing you guys what I'm doing instead of talking about it. Um, I don't know, it probably would be better for the video, but you know what? I, I, I don't know. Uh, so, I hope you all enjoy. Uh, just to make sure, also, um, this penguin house is housing the African penguins and the little penguins. I did not include the king penguins because African and little blue also live on like shore kind of beaches and shorelines and the king penguin is more like arctic region and colder which wouldn't really fit with the theme of the habitat and I can't really, I, I was originally going to include all three species but it was hard to um, include them all with like a consecutive theme of a habitat. But anyway, uh, I hope you all enjoy. Uh, there is no penguins in the exhibit in the cinematic shots because there is no ab outdoor habitat. There will be penguins in there um, and then in the part two video, I promise. I hope you all enjoy. Uh, I, I really hope you guys enjoy the, the content recently. I feel like I've been hitting it out of the ballpark, but I don't know, that's just me. Let me know how you're enjoying the, vid, uh, the content. It really helps me out and let me know what I can do better, if I'm doing good, I don't know. Um, our, my goal for my personal goal is to reach a thousand subscribers by the end of the year or by the end or by the next DLC which will probably be in the beginning of December so maybe we just maybe we could get early access to the uh, to a pack I'm really hoping because if, if the next pack is what I've envisioned for like the next pack I've envisioned for like six months or eight months or whatever which is the Highlands animal pack again check out the speculation thread or whatever the speculation um, video if you want to check that out but I'm really hoping that we can grow this channel out a bit more into the next year um, so they can hopefully have early access to one pack before the game support ends um, yeah uh, so anyway I hope you all enjoy I will see you all in the next one uh, enjoy what's rest what's left of the speed build and I'll see you in the cinematic shots actually no I won't because I'm not gonna hmm. I'll, 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 I'll see you guys next week bye guys